La Bamba. Oh. It does not. So it's a Saturday evening. We haven't vlogged today or anything at all of this weekend yet because we have a pretty mammoth filming session coming up. Uh, we've both got a couple of days off from work, so... Uh, I have two weeks off from work. Yeah, well, okay. Well, I have uh, up until Tuesday off, so... Well, you have Tuesday off, so you have up yeah. until Wednesday off. up until Wednesday. So we are going back to yours to do some filming. Yeah, well, to my parents' house. I live here now, don't forget. <laughs> yeah, that's what I meant. So we're going back to Buckinghamshire tomorrow morning. I'm going to get loads of things. Maybe take the drone, fly the drone about, go some fun places. My parents are getting us Chinese food. Now it's my brother's birthday and we're going out for that and then on Wednesday we'll stay for dinner so we don't have to cook when we get in and then we'll drive home. <laughs> Sound like a good idea? Yes, but only on Tuesday because I have work on Wednesday. Well, yeah. And then I can do whatever for the rest of the week, probably sleep. But you said Wednesday. I meant Tuesday. You confused me. <laughs> so that's what we're going to do. We're editing the vlog right now for the last... That has to go up on Monday. So we need it done now so that we can not worry about it when we are back at yours. But now we've added an extra layer to that. And another one! This is still funny to us. <laughs> I don't even care if anyone else finds this funny. I find it really funny, so we're gonna do it. I find it funny too! <laughs> Dumbo! Oh. There's no Dumbo this week. Camera for a bit. People are all orange, everyone looks like ultra tanned. Oh. Yeah. But not in like a good way, um, like in like an orange juice. Will it turn out? Yeah. yeah. Vlog is all finished. We are doing the rendering now. We are getting it rendered. And while that is doing it, we are going to start packing our things for tomorrow because we have a lot of random stuff that we need to bring with us. And we want to make sure that we don't forget anything. We could probably talk about that actually because this is going to go up after the videos are filmed. Sure, yeah. Well, I'm going to cover it all in the vlog tomorrow. When it's actually like... You carry on then. Yeah. Ignore me. So we're going to get some of the things together and then go to bed and get up early and head up to Buckinghamshire in the morning. Home to Bucks where the air is nice and fresh. Did you read, random, random, just completely out there, I was reading an, an article from the Daily Echo today and they were saying about how toxic the air is in Southampton because yeah, it's Yeah, it's pretty bad. And how 11 people die a year from pollution in Southampton. Yeah. So every so often I feel we need to go back to the countryside so we can like lap up that fresh air. I don't think it works like that. Oh well. It will kind of, because when people smoke, when they stop smoking, their lungs get better. Yeah, when they stop for a while. Maybe we should just move to the countryside. No. I'm from the country! It I don't would be like so boring and I'd hate it. Yeah, but we could sit in a garden and get guinea I pigs. I don't care. And you could have a barbecue! I don't really care. Think of all the barbecue meats you could make! Hey everyone, so we are on the road. We are headed off to Buckinghamshire. It's a nice day. We're leaving quite early because where we live, like, coastal, that's where most people go for the weekend. Um, so, like, any later in the afternoon going back towards London is a nightmare. So if we go to London early, hopefully we'll miss all the people going back to work that way. We're about to go past Marwell Zoo though. <laughs> with all the zebras. Yes, with the zebras. Um, we're pretty close to where my parents live, um, but we found a little farm shop. So we're going to go and see what they have just before we turn up. Maybe they'll have some cool stuff that we can use for videos or that we can take home with us. So we're going to go have a little look around because we are now in the countryside. It's all well, green and stuff. Well, that bit doesn't look too yeah, green. Yeah, no, there's but... like a fence there. <laughs> but we're in the country, so we're going to go in this home barn and they've got antiques and they've got all fun things. Let's go have a look. So that was a very quick trip to the farm shop. They didn't really have anything worth getting so no i think it's too late in the day now i think to go to a farm shop you really have to be there like first light <laughs> but um it's now like 10 to 1 so everything was kind of myth and gone wasn't it yeah so we'll probably just do all our shopping at waitrose and MS instead yeah and then maybe tesco and see how we, what we get yeah so we're gonna head to my parents now drop off all of our stuff and then go straight to waitrose because i'm pretty sure it'll close at like five today yeah cool so we dropped everything off just fine. We are now at the big Waitrose. Okay. Looking forward to this. It's bigger than the one near us and is nicer than the one near us. So we're going to be able to get some really good stuff. Get all the baking things that we need. Anything we don't get, we'll go to the M&S. Might go buy some scales at uh, John Lewis as well. Sarah literally loves doing the quick checkout stuff. Personally, I don't really get it. I don't think it's that much faster, but keeps her happy, so. 
I made a boo-boo. We were in there and then I realised I didn't bring any of the actual baking stuff with me, like my pots and my big baking bowl and my mixer and scales and... You had one job. I know, I messed up. I didn't do a good job. So we have to go to John Lewis now and buy it all back, basically. Or I could drive home to back to Southampton tomorrow to pick it up, to bring it back. <sighs> well, I think all we'll need really is scales and a bowl. Yeah, hopefully. Hopefully. We'll go have a look in John Lewis. I think this might quite literally be the worst laid out car park I've ever seen. There is random bits of car parking all the way over there, random structures over there. I can't even see the shop. It's somewhere over there, I guess. But yeah, we're at John Lewis. I don't like their car park, but we're gonna go see what they've got by way of baking things. So yeah, I managed to pick up the Heston Blumenthal Precision Scales that I've actually been looking at for a while. So unexpected expense, but one that in the long run I was gonna buy anyway. So it's and not get the end bowl. of the world. And yeah, we got another amazing cash uh, mixing bowl. And now we are gonna go to m and for the last bits of food and stuff we need and then back to yours to yeah, relax. Eat. We had to go to two m &Ss in the end. Uh, they didn't quite have everything we needed at one. We've got pretty much everything now though, which is great. So we are kind of all set. I'm so done with driving to supermarkets. I usually like shopping, but this is not enjoyable. And it's now uh, 3.58 and I haven't eaten yet today. And I'm like getting really hungry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, yes. it's just fine and go home. I can't be bothered anymore. I'm at the park with my brothers who have both disappeared the other side of the camera. And I'm with the dog, Milo, which is him. So I'm going to throw this and see if he'll get it. And it's really entertaining. You ready, doggy? Go! Bye! Stupid dog. And while I'm doing that, Ash is setting up his drone. Because I think he's gonna, oh, Joe's in the shot. <laughs> I think he's gonna do some filming in a sec. Milo doesn't like it. Woo! There it goes. Right, the doggy wants to play. Oh, okay, ready? Try not to hit the drone. Good luck. Oh, I didn't know you were right behind me. I said try not to hit the drone. Good luck with hitting the drone. Yeah, but I, oh yeah, it's pretty high. I don't know if you can see it up there. It's only at 30 meters. Oh really? We go up another 90. That's 30. Yep. So Sarah's using the drone for the first time. Never used it before. It's going well. She's getting the hang of it. Just don't fly it into any trees. How long have you had this drone for? A few months now, actually. You've never used it, Sarah. We just played Labyrinth with my little brother, which is basically a game where you just move a tile and then I won. <laughs> which sucks for everyone because Sarah is not a very gracious winner at all. But I'm a bad loser as well, so it's probably better that I won. Barely though. Mm-hmm. We ate some chocolate finger biscuits, which were good, and then we're just gonna go sit in the lounge for a bit now and just chill out and then lots of filming to be done tomorrow. Very busy day. Mm-hmm. I'm really tired just because we've been driving all day, so I'm excited to sit down and not do anything. Good morning, so we're getting set up to film the first video. Uh, it's pretty early in the morning, we want to get started nice and early so that we've got all day to get this done. Despite having all of this stuff, we managed not to have the microphone that we need for filming, so we've had to drive all the way back to Southampton and then all the way back here, uh, which is about a three hour round trip, which sucks. So we're going to change what we're filming and just move straight onto the cake that we need for today, because it's for Sarah's brother's birthday. And then we're going to film everything else tomorrow, I think, is the plan. So we're going to get some food, then reset up and get ready to go. And hopefully we haven't lost anything else because we are not going back again. That would be ridiculous. For lunch, I'm having an American classic grilled cheese sandwich. Really happy with it. It's coming together nicely. Got some ham in there as well. So yeah, it's not a true grilled cheese sandwich, but whatever. It's my sandwich. Come over here and say hello to the camera. This dog does not like cameras, I've learned this. 
No. So the first of our baking things is in the oven. We are waiting for that to finish cooking, tidy the sides back up, and uh, getting stuff ready for phase two, which is putting Sarah in jail. Yeah. Baking jail. It was really all right. Crimes actually. against baking. Crimes against baking? Yeah. What crimes against baking? I've got my mouth chocolatiers top on. Crimes against baking. What did I do wrong? <laughs> smells really good. Look in the oven, try the oven. It's rising quite a bit actually, which is, I don't know if that's what I want. I think they'll settle afterwards, maybe? No, so I'm gonna cut them. So. I mean, really, that does look pretty tall. Well, yeah, I want it to be an epic cake. So we've got all our lights and stuff for filming. And the GoPro, which we haven't used very much of, but no, got just in case clipped on there. We've just been out for dinner. It was really nice. We went to the harvester. Yeah. And now we're going to continue with the baking. Do you want to see where we're at? This is where we're at with the cake. Looks pretty good. we got a final step to go, yeah, so we're going to get on to that now. Well, then I need to tidy up. Yes, so lots of tidying to do as well. And then, look at this extra cake we have. So we might make some like cake pops or something with all this extra cake, because there's quite a bit there. There is quite a bit. So, it's pretty good cake. I like that cake. Go on, Matt. Yay! Well done. <laughs> well done. Cake seem to have gone down well. It's in the fridge right now, just final cooling before we cut some slices. Mm-hmm. At like... 10 o'clock, it's fine, it's done. We got there, we made the cake, we didn't have to buy a Colin. We haven't tried it yet, but. We may still have to buy a Colin. We may still have to buy a Colin. Good morning, so we are in the middle of filming our scrambled eggs video. Sarah is gonna get some scrambled eggs and American bacon for breakfast, and we're gonna do a video on that, and I'm dropping little bits of GoPro everywhere. So mm -hmm. we're just gonna wait for the eggs to, to do their thing, and then put some bacon in in a second. Yep, this is the setup. So this is my parents' kitchen as we did yesterday. It's all set up, ready to film. I'm currently recording, so you can probably actually hear me on the main thing. So I'm just gonna watch him do his magic for a second. More vlog inception, except filming inception this time. <laughs> this looks ridiculous. Oh no. It's like an octopus GoPro. Oh, we got these new scales yesterday. They're actually really cool. Heston Blumenthal. So they scratch really easily, they've already got a scratch on them, which is annoying. That's weird, it's upside down, but it looks kind of cool. <laughs> it's so I can get it really low. Ah. So I have a grilled cheese sandwich, another one. I really like these, I just don't eat bread much anymore, so while I'm on holiday, might as well make the most of it. Doing a quick transfer of all the footage so that we've got a nice free memory card to continue filming today. We filmed so much yesterday that it completely filled one of my 64 gig cards. So that's not good and we need some more space back. So flash forward to Halloween, woo! Look at the little deco. We've got little Halloween signs. Happy Halloween, if you saw our last vlog, you would recognize this. Some nice Halloweeny things, Halloweeny lipstick, Halloweeny everything. Yep. So we've been busy filming videos all day. It's about sort of three o'clock now. We stopped for lunch really quickly, uh, but yeah, it's just been a, a long day of filming, I think. Uh, yeah. It's a shame because we had three more recipes we wanted to get done, but because of the hold up yesterday, we haven't had time. So I think we're just gonna have to come back at another point, um, just book another day off, and yeah. we'll come down and. Do all the Christmas ones. So like, we're gonna start getting some of our things together now. Yeah, because we do have to drive back to Southampton again today. So that'll be the third day I've gone to Southampton or back. <laughs> so that's gonna be interesting. And yeah, just wait for the cake to cool. Do you wanna have a look at it? You might as well. Because it's nowhere near where it's meant to be. This is gonna be something that doesn't look anything like this. Ooh, mystery. Ooh. Ooh. I really miss this kitchen. It's so like open. Like, you can't do this in our kitchen. So we've had a bit of a cake fail. Yeah, I don't know what it is with the oven in this house, but it doesn't cook cake properly. So it's not really like cooked in the middle. It's cooked, but like to make it a cake pop, you need to be quite dry and it's really kind of not. So I think we're just gonna have to recreate it at home and see if we can do it again with our oven, because I know our oven. I don't know these ovens. So yeah, I think we're gonna just stop, clear up for a bit. I mean, the ingredients that we used in that weren't that expensive, like out of all of them. Yeah, we can remake that one quite easily, so, so um, a bit of a shame, but, but never mind. Yeah. 
We've just stopped off at Fleet Services, take a little bit of a break, we're on our way home now. Making fairly good time, traffic hasn't been too bad. Uh, there was quite a bit of tailback, but we left just after rush hour had finished, so that was kind of expected, and it's only really held us up about 10 minutes or so, which is nice. Had a really good time while we were away. It's been a very long and tiring weekend though, so I'm absolutely exhausted, gonna go home got some processing to do on a video so Sarah can edit that and have that going up tomorrow and other than that yeah just gonna take it easy for the rest of the day. Hi everyone so it's actually a few days later than when we last filmed basically we came back from Bucks and I was so tired I think did I literally go straight to bed? We both literally pretty much just went straight to bed. Yeah we were driving not through the night we got back about it wasn't even too late. It was kind of about, about half eight. yeah, half eight or so. But I was just, it's, it had been a really long couple of days. I don't know if you realise, but like when you're filming so much for so long, it's just really tiring. And then to drive all the way back, I was literally dead. I think, no, I went and got McDonald's and then yeah, I, went, did, I yeah. went to bed. I was like, I'm not cooking. So that's kind of what we did. So I think we're just going to end the vlog here and then we're gonna start the one this weekend. I don't know who's gonna have the camera. You're gonna have the camera. I'm gonna have the camera. So back. Because I'm not doing anything. I'll take the camera. So I'm going back to Bucks tomorrow um, and I've got family coming down from Scotland. So I'm gonna spend the weekend with them and hopefully, hopefully I'll get some footage. <laughs> Fingers crossed. I'm terrible at vlogging on my own. I get really like... I usually have to make her film. So we'll see what ends up coming out. I'll try really hard though, I promise, but it might be like a 30 second clip. <laughs> okay. So we'll see you next weekend, which is actually tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Oh, we didn't do Vlogception this week, did we? No, because no, you haven't been... Well, no, we didn't. Well, no, we did, because we edited it before we went, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah, because yeah, we had to upload it, so okay. we did. So... We'll just have to film you editing this one. Yeah, which I'll do the bit, yeah. Because you have to edit this at the weekend. I'll edit, I'm going to edit it tonight, hopefully. Okay. So, I will see you later. I'll see you tomorrow, technically, but next weekend for the vlogs. Bye! Bye.